events in the state-of-the-art science laboratory, Apex Education, the secondary faculty. Grade 10 students are currently completing their SBA component. State-of-the-art science laboratory. Future scientists, medical students. Group discussions are being encouraged. These students will be synchronized and moderated. Great tech students. Hard work. Group presentations. Team events. see another big vessel right behind it, this one here. And if you look closely, this, this one here behind it has... We are doing the mammalian heart, which is made up of the cardiac muscle, and it is not found in other parts of the body, and it works 24-7. Alvin will be dissecting the heart, which shows the atrium and the left atrium, the aorta. The atrium, the, this is the vena cava. Yes. Um, these are the valves, the tricuspid and bicuspid valves. Dissection of the aorta, which is the main blood vessel of the body, which pumps blood out of the heart into the body. As you can see, the aorta is a very large blood vessel and it is very thick-walled, which allows a large quantity of blood pressure to push the blood out of the heart into the body. Round of applause, come on! As you can see, these are valves. This is the tricuspid and this is the bicuspid. What these valves do is they prevent the backflow of blood into the chambers. Round of applause, come on! Diagrammatic representation of the heart. Anatomy of the heart, the digestive system, and how the digestive system works. Round of applause, come on! Go ahead and stand to do this. Um, I tip it up so that I can see the apex well, and then I keep in mind all of this over here is the front, and I take it right down from the middle of the apex and start a downward section. Cow hearts are so large, it takes a bit to do this, and they have some dense connective tissues that make up kind of the skeleton of the heart, so it's kind of tough to get through them, but Bear with me for a minute here. We're not all the way through, but you can nicely see the inside now, can't you? I'm just going to continue my... The left ventricle always has a, has a thicker wall because the left ventricle is pushing blood out to the body. It has to push it really hard to get it out to the whole body. Um, there's, a, there's good back next door to the lungs. So it doesn't need as much force, it therefore does not need as much muscle. And this is the anatomy of the cow's heart. I hope you find this interesting and educational.
Keep watching Apex Forum for more science, technology, and innovation. Give them a round of applause, come on! Already starting to see very large organs. Apex Education Period. Science Laboratory. Students will attempt to dissect a shark to examine the digestive system. So it's really, oh, he's got a little special treat to share with us in his stomach, too. What the hell is that? Wow, we'll just be patient. Okay, so what do we got here? Why is it so huge? And that's a specimen to be dissected. Now the specimen is a black fin shark. Specimen. Dissection of a black fin shark. So, right here, we're going to put a slit. Students in deep concentration. Grade 10 students. The science stream. Dissection of a black fin shark. This is a specimen of a black fin shark. Uh, this is a male because it has two claspers. For a female, they will have one. This is a specimen of a black fin shark. They have claspers, black sharks. So this is a male because it has two claspers. For a female, they will have one. Specimen's liver, which secretes oil in order for the fish to float. This is the heart. This is a specimen's liver, which is responsible for secreting oil in order for the fish to float, and this is the heart. The shark's anatomy, the digestive system, the intestine. I hope you find this interesting, and I hope you join Team Make Bags. To pursue science, the science program. Round of applause! PowerPoint presentation. My colleague will imprint a six layer density tower among immiscible liquids, and I will be sharing a few highlights on this. I will be doing an experiment on the density tower using these substances and honey. Dish soap. Water mixed with coloring oil and alcohol mixed with food coloring and the experiment round of applause come on Density is the measurement that compares the amount of matter an object has to its volume. The reason why these substances are separated is because they have a different level of density. Thus, the higher the substances with a higher density sink to the bottom, while the substances with a lower density rise to the top. Big round of applause! Come on. An experiment called elephant toothpaste. Um, in this experiment, there'll be a foam. Uh, the foam uh, is a hydrogen peroxide and potassium iodide used as catalysts to speed up the chemical reaction. Um, we're gonna use this 3% hydrogen peroxide. We're gonna measure it up to 40 cubic centimeters. Secondly, we're going to pour the soap liquid into the hydrogen peroxide. Mm -hmm. 
決めて入れてきたのになるんですかあの、アリエスのコーディーチョコパンいきなさいなお、これがコーディーのポタージュアイライトリアクションそして、ポタジウムパーマグネットはスピードアップのリアクションそして、10cm のパーマグネットはスピードアップのリアクションそして、10cm のパーマグネットはスピードアップのリアクション Finally, pour. Then you mix in the mixture together. And lastly, uh, we add the hydrogen peroxide. Boom! Exothermic reaction. Big round of applause! Come on! To them. My colleague and I will be demonstrating how to make a lavula. Firstly, we'll be adding some oil into the glass beaker. Then we'll be pouring some water. Then a few drops of food color and then broken pieces of aspirin. As you can see, by adding oil into the glass beaker, and pouring some water into With a few drops of food coloring. And by and by and by adding broken pieces of aspirin into the glass cylinder, we will be seeing the reaction. Wow, wow, beautiful, beautiful. A big round of applause. Wow. My colleagues and I are for for science. We'll be explaining what is crude oil, the process of crude oil, the extraction and the byproducts of crude oil. Over to you. Crude oil is commonly known as petroleum. It's also a liquid found, on, found in earth and comprised of hydrocarbons, organic compounds, and small amount of metals. We are all Guyanese. Do you know where Kruda can be found in Guyana? Okay, Kruda can be found in Barbies, Currenty, and Demoir. Extraction of Kruda. In order for Kruda to be extracted, it will be conduct a test or an experiment using explosives and the testing glass. If Kruda is then present, they conduct a first drill. The first drill indicates whether crude oil is of a large amount of or of a small amount. The if crude oil is of a large amount, they then conduct a second drilling. And that is how crude oil is extracted. Round of applause, come on! The process of separating crude oil is, is called fractional distillation. Crude oil is heated at 400 degrees Celsius at the bottom of the distillating top. As it gets to the top, it cools down. Fractions are separated. Here are some byproducts. Thank you, Sean. Cracking. Cracking is a process where long chain hydrocarbons are broken into small light chain hydrocarbons. The carbon carbon bond of long chain alkene are broken into smaller forms, which are called alkenes, which has economical value. For this to happen, it involves the process of heat, 
and a catalyst which breaks it down, which is present inside the fractional distillation tank, where the byproducts are determined, the byproduct states are determined by the amount of heat present. Thank you. Over to you, Mr. Natalia. Some benefits of Crude Island Guyana include heat, which is used as an insulation in areas where there are low temperatures. It's also used as lubricant in factories in order for machines to be operated efficiently. It could also be one of the byproducts, asphalt, is used in the construction of roads in order for cars, trucks, and heavy duty vehicles to move on. And lastly, it could be used in the manufacturing of furniture, where at least 15 to 16 gallons of crude oil is used to make one so Round of applause, come on! is kerosene and gasoline. Kerosene is used in jet engine fuels, lamps, and lighting fuels. Gasoline is used in electricity generators for portable and emergency supplies. It's also used in cars, SUVs, light trucks, and motorcycles. Over to you. Tar. Tar was used as, as a seal for roofing, painting exterior walls of log buildings with oil. Used in industrial burners, lubricants and heavy, heavy machines, alcohol, it's a up, pharmaceutical application. Pharmaceutical application, alcohol. Plastic. Plastic is used safety gear and packaging. Lubricant is used as to prevent heat from transferring and it's also used to prevent corrosion. Asphalt is used in production of roads. Benzene. Benzene is used in painting and uh, processing of chemicals and jet fuel. Petroleum jelly. Petroleum jelly can be used to heal minor scrapes and burns and is used to unwedge wedge objects. On this display we have some um, crude, we have crude oil and byproducts of crude oil, bitumen, kerosene, crude oil, gasoline, asphalt, waste oil, lubricant, petroleum, diesel and alcohol. Aspirin into Still in the way we see in the reaction. Wow, wow. beautiful, beautiful. A big round of applause. Wow. Faculty. 